All right, time to check out the latest update uh, for H3VR's Alpha Cycle. Uh, sorry, I haven't been able to play uh, the whole week. I've just been busy. In fact, I am busy today, so I'm going to try to keep this short because I got to do some stuff in a couple of hours. In fact, I haven't had time to uh, actually prepare my play space, so if I don't move around too much, it's because I have stuff in the way, you know? And usually I move them out of the way so I can have a bigger play space, but right now there's like a fan and some boxes and stuff like that. But uh, I'll just try to stay in one place. Hopefully I don't run into anything. Just been too busy. Sorry about that, but uh, we're going to check out this latest update. Got the patch notes here. Uh, first things first, uh, we got some new additions to the item spawner. Uh, let's check them out. I right, got one of them out there, but uh, Anton has decided to add uh, some of the uh, stuff that's not in the item spawner. Like, well, we'll talk about that in a minute. Like, the Cyber Pistol. Yes, it's finally in the item spawner. No more having to try to find it inside of the friendly 45 range. Uh, hopefully this is... Uh, not obscured, uh, whatever, uh, my mic stand is right there. But yeah, so now it's in the item spawner, and uh, presumably that means it can probably be vaulted. So, yeah, but we got our uh, cyber pistol in the game, uh, in the item spawner. No more having to hunt for it. And uh, yeah, still looks the same, nothing different about it, but... We got the magazines. And, uh, man, that is very loud. I think. Hopefully my audio settings haven't, uh, haven't really changed, right? Everyone, uh, uh, sorry. Th again, it was pretty loud for me, so. That is so weird. Let me just check something out. Oh, man, I can't believe I have to do this in the middle of recording. Check out my audio settings. Come on, where are you? Recording. Recording's fine. Levels are good. 85%. Yep. Speakers. Why? Why is this so... Okay, nope, that's not... That cut out all the sound in my game. That's not good. I'll be right back, guys. Hold on. All right, sorry about that, guys. <laughs> I just realized why everything was so loud. Uh, when I over the over the week, I managed to clean my computer, and whenever I, whenever I unplug something from the computer, right, all the audio settings just I don't know what what the hell is wrong with Windows. Again, this is Windows. Uh, Windows 10, whatever. But it seems like uh, for my HCC Vive speakers, well, the uh, Deluxe Audio Strap I'm wearing right now, it set the uh, volume to 100%. So it's kind of deafening. I usually set it to like, what, 25? Just to save my ears, because I don't want to ruin them any further. Let me tell you something. Uh, having tinnitus is not good. All you, uh, all you folks out there who are still pretty young, Take care of your ears because it sucks when uh, you start losing hearing. So, yeah, don't be cool like me and try to listen to things at max volume and suddenly you're like in your 30s, 40s, you can't hear anything. So, but yeah, that's why I just looked at my audio settings and man, they were like maxed out. So, yeah, that's why it was so loud. I just, uh, it kind of surprised me there. So, let me try this again. Hopefully the Windows audio should be fine. It's just that the uh, speakers for the headset I'm wearing are lowered. But the audio should be good on the video. Yes, okay. Looks like it. Let me check the audio levels by looking at the graph here. Sorry if I'm looking up. I mean, you know what? I'll just angle my gun up so you guys can see it while I'm looking at the levels on OBS. Yeah, it seems to be good. It's not clipping or anything. All right. Okay, so where was I? Oh, man. That, like, like I said, that the audio level was too high, so it just surprised me. But uh, this is the Cyber Pistol. It's in the item spawner. 
Hopefully I'm recording, right? Yes, okay, good. And, uh, yeah. Let me, uh, let me spawn the, uh, whatchamacallit, the ammo panel, because this uses 10 millimeter DSM, the little fictional 10 millimeter cartridge that, uh, Anton put in for the game for the, uh, Blade Runner, uh, Deckard's Blaster, whatever it's called, the LAPD 2019. But yeah, this one uses the same kind of ammunition. Futuristic. That is fragmentation. This is swarm. Swarm shot. Sort of like a buckshot. Oh, I don't know why I ejected that magazine. I don't need to do that. Tracer. Turbo penetrator, which is like an armor piercing. And Proximity Mine, which is, uh, I haven't used this in a while, so this might be kind of broken. There we go. Oh, no, that was my fan. Oh, sorry about that. Need to move over to the side a bit. But yeah, so the Cyber Pistol in the game. Cool. Cool stuff. Click. All right. Now, what else? Update... Uh, let's see, the long flop, yes, we finally got the long flop in the item spawner. This one you had to find, I think, in the winter snow globe, right? Christmas snow globe, meet miss, meet miss snow globe. And, uh, yeah, like Anton said, it was a joke. Uh, Richard Longflop, I think, was the user. Back in like 2017, 2018. I don't know if you guys uh, were there around there back then, but uh, it was a pretty funny joke. And Anton decided to add the long flop into the game because, well, you want, uh, you know, someone wanted like uh, 1911 with a very large slide. So, yeah, I think this is um, a machine pistol. Uh, so... We're going to take one of the uh, the uh, extended magazines for the 1911, the Derringer, and all right, yeah. So yeah, it's in the game. Uh, it's in the item spawn now. And uh, if I think, uh, if I get this straight, since it's in the item spawner, this can be vaulted. So let's vault this baby. Oops, need to get that out of the... Oh, God, it's so long. Save load. Yeah, I understand. All right, there's all my stuff that I... Uh, my pistols. Let's save this one. New scan. Oh, I don't think you can scan this. Huh. No, you can't. Makes a nice sound. No, I don't think you can scan this. Hmm. Still fun to shoot, though, but... Let's just put this back. Let me see if I can do this. Oh, goodness, that is my mic stand. Uh, forgot about it. Oh, well, the cyber handgun works, so I guess that is a bug with the long flopper. Uh, there's no ammo in this thing. I don't know why I didn't uh, spawn ammo. Whatever. You know what? I want... I want... Uh, turbo Penetrator? Tracer. Swarm. I want Swarm. Let's fill this baby up. Okay, cool. Oh, wait! Uh, wait, hold on. Let me just try something. Yeah... This is not going to work, right? No, this is not going to work. Oh, man. You know, I thought it would work with uh, suppressors and stuff like that, but that's okay. Oh, you know what? Let me try something else. Let's see if this works. This is probably not going to work, but uh, no, it's not going to work. Um, those little adapters. No, I don't think it's going to work at all. Oh, uh, whatever. That's fine. So, 
Let's scan this. Let's put this in the uh, shelf here. Uh, cyber handgun. That's right. C Y B E R. Oops. H A N D G U N. Save. Cool. But oh, but definitely the long flopper does not. Yeah, that's just too bad. I guess that's just a bug since the uh, cyber handgun can work. Get rid of that. Okay, moving on. What else we got? The taking a look at the change log here. Let me just get rid of this audio panel. Uh, hot dog grenade, which we got one right here. Whoops. It's a hot dog grenade. It was always in the game, but uh, it never really was in the item spawner until now. Whoops. Ooh. Oh, God, that's a bet. <laughs> yeah, my throw is terrible. Ugh. Terrible, terrible throw. Okay, well, one more time. This should work. There we go. There you go. A hot dog grenade. Uh, like I said, it's been in the game for a while. It was just never in the item spawner. And now it's there. And what else? Let me uh, check my change log here. To do rail cameras, camcorders, which are in the tools and toys section. Uh, that's not it. Utility. They get the camcorder, rail camera. They're there. And uh, by, you know, again, assuming since they're in the item spawner, they can be vaulted. So let me try to grab something that has a rail on it. I'll talk about that in a minute. Let's grab ourselves a... Uh, let's get the AR-50, new one, All right? So, we've got a rail camera, attaches to the uh, thing. In fact, where is my cam preview here? This is, let's see, spawned object. How do you turn this on again? Completely forgot. There we go. Oh. Let's move this around. Oh, that's a that's another new change that Anton uh, put in the game. If you let me just uh if you click the uh the uh, camera itself, you can change its position. Can you see that? Hopefully. It says click to change angle. So that's a new thing that Anton decided to add. And I think that's the angle we want to go with. So, bond object, it's upside down for some reason. Okay. Now that's... Nope. There we go. Oh, good. So, yep, rail cam. Rail is on the camera. Uh, need to change the smoothing, but whatever. Just an example, all right? Camera is on the gun. And presumably this can be vaulted just fine. Let me just grab a bullet here. Okay. We got a camera on a gun. Hopefully the uh, affected camera is on me. Otherwise it'd be really weird. Save load. Yes. Okay. Looks like we've got ourselves a camera on a gun. You can save it. So now you guys out there who like to do uh, weird, cool, you know, uh, camera on gun builds, you can save them now. Sweet. That's cool, though. I like that. So, yeah, that's the uh, camera camcorders in there as well. I think you can probably save that. I don't know. Whatever. Spawn it. Go save and load. Oop. 
Yeah, you can save a camcorder if you really wanted to. I don't know why you would, but uh, yeah. Oops, did I set that? Oh my goodness. Okay. Cool. So that is in the item spawner. What else we got? What else? Uh, gumdrop. Oh. Yeah, yeah, the glow stick. So glow stick. It's a light source, so Anton says not to spawn too many of these. Actually, we need a darker environment. Let's go over here. Ah. This area is clear. And then, like I said, Anton said that uh, this is a uh, light source, so if you spawn too many, I think it might slow the game down. Hmm, seems to be okay. Well, not, uh, not, I guess not slow the game down, just make some weird stuff happen. Like there are now different light sources all over the place. Yeah, see, it's kind of overriding some of the lights whatever i need to uh reload the scene so so glow sticks um uh, come on let's see glow sticks targets yes so we got some new targets well not new targets they're kind of old but we got some gum drops giant peppermint is in there i think it was already in there but yeah right so we got these gumdrops. Spawn them. You can shoot them. Whoa. Oh, that was my mic stand. Not good. Grab ourselves the test gun here. They disappear eventually, right? No, I don't think they do. Nice juicy sounds. Can we? I don't think he can. Oh, you can. Small and lock him. Oh God, that was my uh, that was my mic stand. I'm so stupid. I keep forgetting it's there. Uh, yeah. Whatever. But you can spawn lock it. Cool stuff. Okay, so, uh, gumdrops. Let's see, that was it for the additions. We got some Sosa guns, but I don't know if those uh, are uh, very interesting. Are they? I don't know if they're interesting. Go back, go back. Sosa guns. Uh, some of the more Russian-oriented Sosa guns. Ash. Uh, ASH-12, the Keter, PKM, RG-6, SVDS, Makarov, uh, Taz-106, yep, so all the Russian-style uh, Sosa guns are in the item spawner, if you want to play with those. Let's uh, spawn the Makarov. Wait, hold on, can you vault Sosa guns? I don't mean... I mean, it'd be kind of pointless, but let's just see. Oh, you can for some reason. Uh, <laughs> cool. Yeah. So they're in the item spawner now. There you go. So Sosa guns. Uh, I think that's about it for the additions. There's some changes. Uh, collision spring response on popper targets. Yes, I think Anton showed this off, but we're going to check it out right now. But yep, those have been changed so that it's no longer like, you know, I mean, if you remember from last week, you know, I would take a it would take a full magazine to uh, tip these guys over. But now it's just about one shot. And yeah. 
Uh, no challenge shooting them from this distance, but uh, let me just uh, see if we can get it from over here. Oops, missed. Yeah, all right, cool. The poppers have been tweaked, as is the uh, dueling tree over here. It doesn't freak out on you anymore. Well, it does freak out, but uh, not as bad as it was back then. So you can put it back down, and you got to manually set it up again, which I don't want to do because, again, I have all this stuff in my room. This is a this is a mic stand. Okay. <laughs> I really need to get a, bi a better, bigger room. That's not going to be really possible, but... but yeah, so, you know, you just have to fix it. And uh, once it's fixed... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Had to clear my throat. But, yeah. Oh, I missed that last shot. Not that hard when you're sitting right next to it. <coughs> but, uh, yeah... I just want to shoot at the du uh, dueling tree here. Oh, man, I missed that shot. Hate it when that happens. It should be it should be relatively easy since I'm standing so close to it, but oh, man. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Ugh. You know, what, hold on. I got to fix this. There we go. Terrible, terrible, just terrible performance all around, I swear. Okay. Uh, no, I like the dueling tree. It's, it's very fun to play around with. Okay. All right. Cool. All right. Cool. Ah, no, 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 no. No. <laughs> it's very easy when they're all lined up on one side. Oh, I can't believe I missed that. Wait, hold on. Oh, I don't want to hit anything here. There we go. So the dueling tree has been uh, fixed. Do, do, do. Changes to Sosa Gun Recoil. Sosa Gun Uzi now is 20 round capacity instead of 32. Cool. All right. Yeah. Those are the fixes. Uh, changes, sorry. Then some fixes. Lots of uh, lots of items from the item spawner that weren't be or that weren't able to be vaulted can now vault. Uh, one of them, I think I pointed out last week, was the G3 Picatinny Adapter. It's on the list, so that should be pretty good. Uh, let me grab a... I don't know why I did that. Let me grab a... Uh... Let's grab a G3. Alright. Yeah. Let's grab a G3. Good old G3, H and K. Very cool. Rail adapter. Where is the G3? This one gave us a lot of trouble last last week. It should be fixed. Uh, let's grab ourselves a scope. Just uh. Oh right. The uh, also the uh, what should we call it? The uh, ham ham R the hammer. Uh, is also one of the objects that was fixed, I think. Uh, where is this? Fixed missing reference on ham combo scope preventing serialization or, you know, saving. So that should be in the magnifier. Oh, there we go. So this should be fixed. This should be good. There we go. I don't know why it was uh, broken last time, but Anton said he fixed it. So uh, these two should scan. Yes, sirree, they do. I'm not going to save it because, you know, it's, uh, 
Let's uh, let's do a little bit of shooting with the uh, G3 here. I did not spawn any other magazines. That was my fault. A uh, spawn lock, I mean. Spawn lock, please. Oh, this is a full auto. Forgot about that. HK slap. Cool. So yeah, the uh, a lot of a lot of items were fixed in the uh, list here. I can't go through all of them because that would take a lot of time. A plunge launcher. Oh, you know what? Yeah, plunge launcher, spam, use spatial attachments, 30 carbine mag for the Thompson, uh, HCB bolt, whatever, storm grenade stuff, blah, blah, blah. Lots of items. Lots of items have been fixed. So, uh, yeah, I think that is, huh. I think that's all the uh, additions. Uh, there's some more uh, in-depth things there if you want to check it out. Uh, the uh, change log. But uh, those are the new additions for this alpha. And again, uh, I don't know how long this video has taken. But I can't spend that much more time on it because, oops, I got to do something. So I think that's about it for today. Hopefully I get some time later on to play some other stuff. I, I know I, I should, you know, I said I was going to play some Taken Hold, but again, like I said, I just don't have enough time. Uh, that's about it for today, and I will see you guys next time.